Hey, Needlebender757 here with another 757 Boulder Built Amplifier video. Hey, this one here uh, is a nice 2 pill 2290 with the variable on it. It's uh, fully biased for sideband. And we got Silent Key Key Up 2024 on it because it's for the upcoming contest. You can uh, find out. Uh, information about that contest uh, on the website uh, for the Needlebenders. It's uh, the, uh, needlebenders.com, the needlebenders.com. So uh, check that out. You can find out the information there. Or you can just send an email to uh, silentkeykeyup2024 uh, at gmail. So uh, check it out. Beautiful box. Fully biased, all the good stuff in there. Heavy duty wires, just real sweet little box. I put a fan in this one uh, just because I can. They normally don't come with one, that's why it's got uh, holes on both sides and everything, but it'll cool better. And there you have it. So uh, they work really good with a standard old radio. Like a Unity Grant XL there, same as the Cobra uh, 148 GTL, and we'll show uh, what this radio does here. Is uh, oh, let me turn the amp off for a second. It does a one and a half watt dead key, and that gives us. It's about a 40 watts out, which is uh, about the uh, max dead key you really want to run with this. Uh, people run more than that, you know, do as you will, but this is just my recommendations. And with that uh, 40 watt dead key there, and uh, let's see what we're modulating here. Audio, audio, uh, 40, uh, we're uh, modulating 22 watts. So it's 1.5 watts in and modulating audio, audio. So that's what we're putting into the uh, box. <coughs> now if I turn the box on, like it is now, audio, audio, it's uh, 40 swinging 300. Which is really, uh, really good. What a great working box that is. And uh, you can dial it down in case you want to use it as a driver for something. Or you can just use it by itself. Uh, it's got the uh, sideband delay here. You know, you can turn it on for a delay or leave it off. Uh, it is fully biased, as you can see in there. Anyway... Works really good with that. Now, if you want to run it harder, you can also pair it with like, a, uh, you know, like a, we'll use a striker here, for instance. We'll uh, turn the striker on, turn this one off, and uh, the striker turned down. It's probably like in any tone or anything. The way I've got this set up, we are. Uh, I can set the dead key at whatever. Let me turn this uh, off again. Well, I set the dead key up a little bit there. We'll just go with a one watt dead key. And uh, it's actually swinging audio, audio. Almost 40 watts, which is probably the max I'd put into this. And we'll turn it on. We have a lower dead key, of course. Audio. Audio, and even though we're hitting it with quite a bit more watts, we're only getting 30 watts out, so it's really pushing it uh, a little too hard, but it can take it. Uh, audio, hello, test. One, two, three, four, hello, audio. Yeah, cruise is right around 330 watts there with the uh, striker running 40 watts into it. Anyway, great working little box. Fan isn't running because the case isn't grounded here. That's how it gets grounded. Put that on and screw it on there, then the fan will be running. Anyway, great little box. Hey, 
Don't forget to register for that Silent Key Key Up so you can win it. This is one of the prizes for the Silent Key Key Up that uh, you can win. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Needlebender757 here in Boulder, Colorado. We're going to get back on the side smoking. See ya.